this meeting is being recorded. That's it, yeah. So just say continue to that. And just to remind you, that's me being recorded, not you. And uh, it's just for a bit of insurance and also so that we can pop it on our website. Right, so welcome, welcome. This is a 30-minute chair-based exercise routine. And this is for you. And this is also just to uh, celebrate the fact that it's National Fitness Day. So we are going to spend 30 minutes exercising in the chair. No equipment needed apart from your chair and yourself and perhaps a glass of water. So come and sit yourself forward so you're on the front third of the chair. So just wiggle your bum forwards so that you have got, let's so turn to the side a sec, so you have got a gap between your back and the back of the chair. All right, so once you've got that gap between your back, hello, where it's going, and the back of the chair, you're using your tummy muscles. All right, so that's the aim of that. So you've got to use your tummy muscles to sit yourself up straight, Bring your shoulders back and down and look forwards. Okay, so let's start with a small pulse raise. And when I say small, I mean quite short with small movements. So just tap your toes for me. All right, and whilst you're tapping your toes, think about your posture, think about how you can lift up tall. Just gently pull in through those abdominals. Pull your shoulders back and down. Nice long neck so you look forwards. Okay, good. Hold on to the chair and start to march through your feet. So you're just holding on to the chair to try and keep your back straight. All right, so that's the idea. Make it small. All right, make it really small. I mean, it's so small. If you want to, you can just lift the heels. All right, so it's entirely up to you. See how you feel this afternoon. See how that lunch is settling down. All right, so you still lift up nice and tall. Now hold those feet still and just swing your arms. Okay, so just your arms swinging forwards and backwards. That's it, pressing those elbows backwards. Good. So again, there's nothing too hectic. So don't do anything that's kind of too massive. Just warming up really, really slowly. Really, really slowly and gradually. All right, so we're not sending, sending ourselves off on a sprint. Okay, hold on to the chair again and march again through your feet, lifting up tall. All right, good. Great stuff, lovely. Okay, and then once again, just swinging those elbows. That's it, hello, hello, hello. Thank you for coming. We're just doing a really small, short warm up. So just a little pulse raise here, just nice and small, nothing too hectic. That's it, small movements. Okay, let's slow it down and stop. Right, here comes our mobility. So just get yourself nice and tall again on the chair, arms down by your side, Let's squeeze your shoulders up and release them down. And do that movement again. Up and down. And I want you to do two more. Lift and lower and try and get that movement up as well as down. All right, you can stop there. Now I want you to give yourself a shoulder roll. So I want you to go forwards up, back and down. And as you roll them back, lift your chest. That's good and feel how that's so good for our posture, bringing those shoulders back and down. Let's do two more. All right, well done. Let's do one more. All right, wonderful. Now you can stop there. Now I want you to roll them forwards. All right, so you'll feel this isn't great for our posture, this one. All right, like you're shrugging on a big coat, but it is good for our shoulders, getting them going forwards as well as backwards. All right, so do one more time. All right, good. Now, let's lift up tall and let's try and get those shoulders to come back again. So arms out in front, squeeze those shoulders back together like that. So go arms in front and then just squeeze those elbows back. So if I turn around, look, you're here. So you are here. So it's just something to try and get those shoulders to squeeze back and lift the chest. Really good for the strength of our shoulders as well as that bit of mobility. Nice one. All right, just do one more time. Just do one more. Lovely. And then you can rest. All right, shoulders back and down. Arms down by your side. Palms up towards the ceiling. Do me a bicep curl. That's it. Just work through those elbows. That's it, a bicep curl. Yeah, great. Lovely stuff. Perfect. Nice and easy. Let's just do one more. Good. And then you can stop. So you can leave those elbows in at your waist and just circle our wrists around. So let's do a circle there of your wrists. 
Yeah, good. Good. All right, let's just circle the wrists around the other way. Off you go. So circle those around, circle those around. Yes, that's it. That's good. Yeah, great. All right, now then, elbows still in at the waist there, palms down, then turn the palms up, then turn the palms down. Turn the palms up and turn the palms down. And just keep that movement going. Just try that twisting movement with your wrists. Very nice. Okay, good. Now then, just try one hand up and then the other hand up. So just try that alternate movement now. Good, so just something to think about, that alternate movement there. Good, great. All right, now then, both palms down. Now, both palms face the camera, so that's it, show me your hands, and then both palms go towards your tummy. Okay, so it's palms up, palms down. So just try that flex and extension. That's it, flex and extension through the wrists, just getting those moving there. Okay, terrific. Good. All right, one more time. And then you can rest, and I want you to give your fingers a wiggle. So wiggle them through, wiggle them through, wiggle them through. Yeah, good. Good. That's it, can you see them? That's it, yeah, good. That's it, yeah. Let's do that sort of piano playing. <laughs> All right, stop there, take them wide and make fists. And do that movement again, wide and fists, wide and fists, like that. So just trying to just work through those fingers, waking them up. Good. All right, let's do it now facing the other way. So palms up and then fingers wide again. So just feel if that feels any different. That's it, good. So just waking them up. That's it, just starting to have that pump through. That's it, do four more, three more, two more, one more, and then you can stop there. Good, now give everything a bit of a wiggle. All right, so we're gonna move down now into the trunk. So just mobilizing the trunk. So lifting up tall, arms down by your side, just gently pull in through that tummy. I want you to lean one way, come on back to the middle, and then lean the other way, and come on back to the middle. All right, and then off you go again, ready? So I want you to go side to side. Now think about how you're gonna lean in a straight line with that hip. Now you can go my speed, or you can go slower, that's fine. Maybe you don't need to go faster, all right, that's good. Lovely stuff. Good. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hello, hello, hello. We're just still warming up. All right, good. Very nice. We're just moving into the trunk now, you see. One more time. Good. Come on back up to the middle. Sit tall. Let's put your right hand onto your left knee and then your other hand onto the back of the chair. Now drop that shoulder down, lift up tall and twist. And then slowly come back round to the middle. And then I want you to change sides. So hands lift and twist. And come on back round to the middle. And let's do that again. So you move your hands across, you lift the chest, and then you twist. And then you come back round to the middle. So it's a good twist through that waist. Sit tall, have that twist, use that hand on the knee to look around. And let's do one more time each side. So take your time as you go, take your time. That's good, so just twisting through, go as far as is comfortable for you. All right, great, and then come on back into the middle here. Now lift up tall again, take one arm, and I want you to push it across the chest, and then the other side, across the chest, and again, across the chest. Now gradually, gradually, Make that movement a little bit bigger. So you reach to the end of the range of movement. Go as far as is comfy for you. Go as far as is comfy for your spine and your shoulder and your arm. That's it. So gently extend through that arm. Yes, good. That's it. Across, good, and across. And if you like, you can look the way you're going. It's up to you. See if that, you know, is all right on your head or you can look forwards. Very nice. All right, let's do one more time each side. All right, let's just do one more. Good, and then you can stop there and you can lift up tall. Similar move, arm up towards the ceiling. So just go, look, nice and gently. That's it, good. 
and as far as it's comfy on that shoulder. So if you've got sore arms today and you want to help that arm across you, please do. All right, so up to you. See how you feel. Now, gradually, gradually, if you want to, you can take the arm up a little bit higher and you reach across a little bit more. But just see how you feel. That's it. See how you feel in the waist. It's just really extending through. That's it. And just do what you can. Do what you feel today. That's it. That's good. So you can see how that's just getting waist moving, getting those arms moving. And it's raising the pulse as well as you take that arm above your head. That's it. So go with it. Go with it. Do one more. Wonderful. And then you can stop and you can lift up tall. Now let's give those arms a swing. So you may take those arms swinging a little bit bigger than they were at the beginning. That's it. Good. Yes. Yeah, so you just swing them through, swing them through. And you can feel how you've got that natural sort of twist as you swing. All right. Let's slow that down. Slow that down. Make the arms go smaller. Good. And hold on to the chair. Now I want you to lift a hip and then lift the other hip. See what is comfy for you. See if you can just that, but get a little bit of air underneath that bum cheek. So you're just lifting the hip, that's it, and lifting the hip. Good. Very nice, very nice, very nice. Good. Lovely stuff. Well done. Great. All right, let's do one more. Stop there, put your hands on the knees. Now, we're going to make a C shape with your spine, but most importantly, I want you to focus on those hips, and I want you to tilt the hips underneath you, look forward and slightly down, and then come on up. Now, nice tall spine. You can just rock and come up. If you have a nice strong spine and you feel all right in moving it into a curved shape, you can exaggerate the movement a bit. All right, but I want you to feel what's okay on your spine. All right, so you might find that actually it's better. Can you see the difference to just keep it a bit more upright? Pull in through those abs. So you're just sort of rocking backwards on the hips. Feel how those hips tilt underneath you. Lift up tall and do one more. All right, that's good. That's good. And you can stop. Pop your hands on the chair again. Lift your bottoms up and come backwards now so you're onto the back of the chair. That's nice. Yeah, that's nice. All right. Knees. Shoulders are back and down. Take one foot under the chair and then lengthen the leg up so it comes nice and straight. Do that movement again. Under and lengthen. So I want you to think about your knee joint, going through its range of movement, going through its range of movement. Good. Very nice. All right, let's just do one more. All right, good. And then you can stop. And let's do the other side. So under and lengthen. So just think about the range of movement of that knee joint. It's going to go under the chair and then it's going to lengthen out so it comes nice and straight. And then just do two more. Work at a speed that suits you. It doesn't have to be as quick as this. It can be slower. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. We're just doing a few repetitions. Good. And stop. All right. Lengthen out that leg again. It doesn't need to be too far out in front of you. Just enough room so you can circle the ankle. That's it. So just give yourself enough room so you can circle your ankle. So circle it all the way around. So if you can imagine it going around a clock face. All right, one way, and then let's go the other way. And that's it. So just around in a circle, drawing a circle with those toes. Very nice. Good. And then you can stop. Put that down. Change sides. So just out in front of you is enough. That's just enough room to circle it around. Good. All okay. You can hold on to that leg if you need to. All right. And then circle it around the other way. Off you go. That's it, yeah, just getting them moving, getting some movement there in your ankle. That's it, as much as you can, keep drawing that circle, drawing that circle, imagining a circle. That's it, drawing it round. Okay, good, and then you can stop there. All right, let's come forward, so you're on the front third of the chair now, so just come forward. We're gonna do a little bit more for your ankles, or I'm gonna start to raise the pulse a bit. So, feet hip width apart, lift up tall and hold on to the chair. Now, have a look at this. We're going to go heel, toe, stop. Then the other side. Heel, toe, stop. Ready? Heel, toe, stop, change legs. Heel, toe, stop, change legs. Heel, toe, 
stop, change legs. Heel, toe, stop, change legs. Heel, toe, stop, change legs. Heel, toe, stop, change legs. Four more. Three more. Two more. One more. Good. Let's start to march through those feet now. So have a march. Nice and low still. That's it. So my knees aren't coming up too high. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Now gradually, gradually make those knees lift a little bit higher. That's it. Hold on to the chest. Keep your back nice and strong. So gradually raising the pulse. Okay. So gradually, gradually. Do what you can. Go at this speed or go slower. Doesn't matter. All right, it doesn't matter. So there's no music. You just go for your own rhythm. Go for your own rhythm. All right, so slow it down. Slow it down. Good, 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 good. Take your hands in front of you. Hello there. And then I want you to go side to side. So you're rowing side to side. Very good. So get that waist engaged. Nicely done. Nicely done. Side to side. Well done. And side. To side, very good. And side, to side, very nice. One more time. Lovely, come back into the middle here. Sit tall and march again. Off you go. A little bit bigger. Now see if you can make it into a knee lift. Ready? You go lift and lift and lift and lift. Good. All right, we're doing brilliantly for time. That's it. So lift and lift. Good. Very nice. Excellent. One more time. Now tap out to the side. Off you go. So tap in, tap in. Good stuff. Good stuff. So we're raising that pulse. That's good. That's good. So you're starting to breathe a little bit more deeply. Work at that speed that suits you. Good work at the range of movement that suits that hip. Very nice. Very nice. Let's go back to the march. Ready, steady. Here we go. Go march and march. Now, can you bring your arms in as well for a swing? There and there. So same moves again. That's good. That's good. That's good. Excellent stuff. Great. Let's do four more here. All right. Now then, can you keep those legs going? Take your hands again to there in front. One thumb on top. And row again. Side. To side. A bit more tricky if you've got your legs going as well. So just see how you go. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Lovely. Well done. Well done. Terrific. Terrific. Good. Four more. Four. Three. Two. All right. Now then slow those feet down and just tap. So just tap. So give those legs a bit of a breather. And I want you to go tap and clap. And tap and clap. And tap and clap, very good. And tap now, clap side to side. So, one side, then the other side. Good. So, keep those feet going. Nicely done. Now, nice deep breaths now. That's good because these movements are much bigger. That's great. Excellent. So, keep that breathing going. Great. Let's do four more. Let's do three more. Good. Let's do two more. Brilliant. Come back into the middle and tap side to side here and here and here. Good. Now, nice and tall. Beautiful. Now, can you add in an arm? That's it. Good. So push across the chest, push across the chest. Good. That's good. That's good. So I don't mind if someone comes down, Oksana. That's okay. That's okay because they may have done a war, their own warm up, possibly. All right. Good. Good. Brilliant stuff. Well done, well done, well done. Good, yeah, that's it. Hello, hello, hello. Work up to this slowly because you're actually joining us now in quite a hard sort of part of the class. So work up to it nice and slowly. All right, let's do a march again. Ready, steady. Here we go. So uh, the, the marching now as suits you. All right, as suits you. All right, so the arms are swinging because your pulse is raised now. All right, so that's it. Work at your own level. Good. We're maintaining nice deep breaths. All right, very good. Very good, very good. So if you can keep marching, we're going to do that row one more time. Ready? So arms in front of you, 
and row side to side. So this is the last time through, by the way. I should have said that at the beginning. We're only going to do this one more time. That's good. That's good. That's good. Excellent stuff. Excellent stuff. Good. You are looking great. Keep marching, keep marching. Ready for your tap and clap again. Ready, here we go. So you're gonna do tap and clap. Now, so if you're joining me now, just work up to it nice and gradually because we're in the hardest point now. All right, now you're gonna clap side to side. Off you go, side to side. When you're ready, join in. Good, so it's nice big movement and you are working hard. You're going out as far as is comfy on your back and your arms. Nice deep breaths. You are doing brilliantly, absolutely brilliantly. Good. Last move on this round. All right, so let's tap out to the side. Ready? Let's go. So you tap out, tap out. You are doing brilliantly. Arm across the chest again. Ready? Push, push. This is really good, really good. That's it. Stay with me. You are doing brilliantly. You've only got a few more minutes left, I promise. Good. Very nice, very nice. Now then. Here is your challenge. All right, I want you to see if you can do a sprint on the spot. All right, so I promise you this is the hardest bit, the very hardest bit. All right, so come on into the middle here and do a little march, just a little long, so I want you to get your breath back. We're gonna do a sprint for four and then a slow march for four and we're gonna do that twice. Okay, so ready, steady, and here we go. So quick beat for four, Three, two, one. Now slow it down and catch your breath. Use arms if you want to, or just hold the chair. We're gonna do that one more time. All right, so take nice deep breaths. Very good, are you ready, steady? To sprint again, last time for a count of four. Ready, and it's four, it's three, it's two, it's one. And now I'm going to slow it down and slow it right down. Give those legs a bit of a run. Now, change the movement so it's a heel dig. So it's a heel dig. So just allow those legs to ease out because we are going to cool down now. All right, we're going to cool down now. That was amazing. Well done. Well done. Good. So it's really raised your heart rate. Keep breathing. Keep breathing. That's it. Lovely stuff. Well done. Good. Good. All right, come back into that spot here and just lift the heels, lift the heels, lift the heels. Now see if you can do a bicep curl, just so that your arms are doing something and you're thinking about, as it, something other than <laughs> how difficult that was. <laughs> All right, well done. Excellent, excellent stuff, good, great. All right, now then. Really little moves now, so just a really small move through the ankle and give those arms a shake out, a shake out, a shake out. That's great, that's great. So we want to cool everything right down now. So it's small moves, it's easy moves here. Very nice, okay. Lovely stuff, lovely stuff. Okay, good. Now I just want you to push just slightly across the chest, very slightly. That's it, so it's nothing too big, it's much smaller. That's it, it's much smaller, good. It's much smaller, good. Now down towards the floor, and you can actually now, if you like, hold your feet still. That's it, and just point down towards the floor. That's it, yeah, and you can gradually, gradually stop those feet. That's it, and gradually, gradually make the arm movements much smaller. Okay, very nice. All right, so our last five minutes then, is to do a bit of stretch and a tiny bit of strength. All right, so we're going to lift up tall. All right, we're going to start off with a little bit of strength, okay? So we're going to work strength of these thighs because they're really important. We're going to do jockey lifts, which means that we do a tiny lift and you sit back down again, ever so small. Move your feet first slightly behind your knees. You can put your hands on the chair or your hands on your thighs. Lean forward, a very small step, very small lift. Ready, like that, and down. Okay, good, let's do that again. So lean forward, small lift, and down. Good, two more. Lean forward, small lift, and down. Excellent, one more time, ready? Lean forward, small lift, and down. Fantastic, good. Move those feet to the underneath your knees again. 
lift up tall. Let's have a chest stretch. So reach round, grab hold of the back of the chair, squeeze those shoulder blades together, lift the chest up. Take nice deep breaths as you work through that chest stretch. Extremely well done, extremely well done. All right, lovely, lovely. And then you can stop there. All right, take your hands in front of you into like a prayer position. And I want you to press the heels of the hands together. So you get a little bit of strength now through those wrists. So press, see if you can have your thumbs close to your sternum. Keep pressing the hands together and allow those hands to come down your sternum towards your tummy, but try and keep the heels of the hands pressed together. You'll feel, you'll feel the stretch and the strength happening there. Come on up, relax. Put them together again, but this time low down towards your lap. So again, see if you can get the heels of the hands together and gradually, gradually draw them up the chest and see, just see how far you can go with them. Still keeping the heels of the hands together, still taking nice deep breaths. Wonderful, and stop and give those a wiggle. Now let's stretch out those wrists. So hand towards me, fingers down, and then pull your fingers back. Take nice deep breaths. Very good, very good, and rest. Now the other side. Ready, so you've got there, fingers down, and then you pull. So, all right, so you're just stretching through. Can you see, stretching through that wrist flexor? Nicely done. Relax, give them a wiggle. All right, a bit more stretching now. So I want you to take one leg out straight in front of you, put the hands on the leg that's bent, lift up tall so you've got a nice lifted chest, and lean forwards. So try and fold forwards to give yourself that stretch through the back of the leg. So this stretch is really good for getting down towards our feet. So it's the sort of putting socks on stretch. And it's also really good for our posture because it keeps our pelvis in a nice straight line. All right, up you come. And then change sides. All right, so you've got the other leg out in front. You lift up tall. And then you fold forwards. Great. All right, we are doing brilliantly. We are doing brilliantly. Okay, excellent. That good long stretch, hold it there. All right, wonderful. And up you come. Right, let's do one more stretch. So lift up tall, put one hand on the chair, reach that arm up to the ceiling. Now reach a little bit taller and lean over. So just go as far as you can. Do what you can there with that stretch. Go as far as you can with that arm. Come on back into the middle and then let's do the other side. Ready? So you're going to go up. See if you can, just go as far as you can. Lift up that little bit taller and then lean over. That's good. So just do what you can there with that waist stretching out. Coming back into the middle, relaxing that arm down, give your shoulders a roll. Fantastic. Relax. Look one way. We are nearly done. Look one way. Look the other way. Good. Come into the middle. Drop one ear towards your shoulder. And then change sides. Oh, my goodness. Well done. That was a quick half an hour. Goodness gracious me. Give your legs a bit of a rub through. How are your knees? How are your ankles? Give your arms a bit of a rub through there. Just sort of congratulate them on that little sort of swift half an hour's workout. And then when you are ready, give yourself a well earned. Goodness me. Well done, everyone. Well done. Thank you, well Sarah. I hope that was all right, quick, really quickly. <laughs> all all right well you're you're free to go but, <laughs> but thank you very very much for coming i really appreciate your support and i hope that thank you very much sarah that was brilliant really thank Love you everyone it. for coming yeah.
Thank you, Michelle. Really, really, very really I'm nice. I start with. Oh, it's really, really nice, actually. A little Zoom like this. Might do it again. We didn't need to do it that. Couldn't we do it this way on Monday? But your enthusiasm carries us. Yeah. You're enthusiastic. You make us yeah. alive. Yeah. Thank you very much. Bye. It really is. Thank really you. Nice Just to you. say, Sarah, I always do your move on Mondays, but it's a different time. Oh, you nice. Good. Yes, I, try, I try to see you on time on Monday. Yes. Yeah. It, make, it makes me do it. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. I know what you mean. I know what you mean. <laughs> Francis, uh, we don't hear you. Bye. 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 Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. David, nice to meet you, properly. <laughs> uh, now you want to <laughs> Yeah, okay. So, uh, these are absolutely excellent. I just loved it. And it was a lot in there and I really enjoyed it. But as your yes, <laughs> uh, but it's great. Uh, as you're videoing them, can we access these at, at any other time to suit ourselves? Yeah. Yeah, we'll put this on the website. I Okay, yeah, yeah. Is that applicable to our other sessions? I mean, I'm with Jenny on um, Thursdays, 